Hello everyone, welcome to Exquisite Info. My topic today is how you can run all these 11 different desktops on one computer on Windows 10. So if you stick around and I'll show you a step-by-step -step tutorial. So before I start off, I'd like to give you an example. Let's say this is you and you are running two different windows on two different desktops. Let's say this is desktop, it's a laptop, let's call it a desktop or laptop, whatever you're going to do. So basically you're doing two different tasks on two different computers right how about if i show you that you will be able to do the same two tasks on this one computer so you'll be able to run any task that you're doing on here on this one here so you wouldn't need this or these extra computers so now i'll show you how exactly you can start this multiple desktop process on one simple computer so what you need to do is you need to click on something called task view so now i'll show you where you can find the task view basically the task view is on the far left of your taskbar it is next to where you see type here to search so next to search bar right here task view so what you do is on the mouse click on the task view so you click on this task view and open up this is my earlier work that was uh, opened up earlier as you can see look this is on one of my desktop so now to open another desktop this is the first desktop that i have to open another desktop you see on the far left top corner new desktop can you see it here right here new desktop so what you do is click on this that should now open a desktop too and if i was to open more then all i do is click new desktop and as many as you want you know there's no i don't know how many you can do i've personally done 11 i've already showed you in the beginning as well so let's just keep you know stop to this one you know let's stop on six so now if i don't want the extra ones what i do is click the crossbar and remove the unnecessary ones so i remove the desktop five four and three i'll stick to one and two so this is how you do it right so i'll show you now how you can run different tasks on these desktops and also the good thing about these is that you can go from one desktop to another very easily so you click on the task view again and go into desktop one and same if you want to go to desktop two click it and go to desktop two now the good thing about this procedure is it will save you a lot of time and also it'll not cause any speed issues on desktops so because you're running on two different desktops so anything you have on desktop one let's let me take you for example let me give you an example yeah this is my desktop one yeah desktop one look i've got a lot of things running on desktop one both these things look the first one is the gumtree and all these websites look there's a uh, youtube and there's fiverr there's trending topics on youtube argos amazon all these shopping sites and youtube again so many of these websites now this is my personal thing so anything i do personally i keep this to myself now if i want to make you know any videos that i'm doing now tutorial and that then i keep uh, do the desktop too because that's empty i showed you desktop one i'll show you desktop two can you see here look filmora it's opened but now like this is desktop one i'll show you this is desktop one you won't see filamora here so now i'm going to go into desktop two look it's here so anything i do work related i do it on the desktop two now this will give me more time you know to work on here and in there if i get bored of this work then i can watch youtube videos on the on desktop one so very simple and if i decided now to move this you know if but I don't want this to be on desktop 2, I want to move it to desktop 1, this uh, Wondershare Filmora. All I do is drag it, so click it and drag it across and take it into desktop 1. So this will now come into desktop 1. Right, so this is how simple it is. So that is how you open, you know, different desktops on one computer. Now, for those of you who like using hotkeys or short keys, I'll show you a very easy steps on how you can do this. The same thing that I've done using the keyboards. So you don't want to use the mouse, you want to use the short keys. Here it is. The first one is to open it, the same, uh, you know, new uh, desktop. What you do is click window plus tab button and it's opened, as you can see. So that's the first part. And now, so now if you want to go to the other desktop, let's say you want to go to desktop two. So all you do is window plus control plus D. Hold that together and let's take you to the next one. And if you want to navigate from left to right, so let's say you want to go to desktop one uh, to desktop two without, you know, choosing the top option. So what you do is press Windows control right. will take you to the other one. And then let's say Windows control left. It'll bring you back. 
So this is how easy it is. So with this whole navigation process, basically what you can do is that you can go from one desktop to another in very easy, just by clicking left or right with Windows Control and left or right. So all you do is it'll take you one way or the other, whichever one you want. And now let's say you've opened quite a lot of desktops and you want to get rid of some of them. So all you do for that is press Windows Control and F4. And again, so now it's shortening. Let me show you as well. So now let me open it first of all. And let's click on Windows Control and F4. And that should be leave us with two desktops. And if I do it again, that should leave us with one. So now I only have the one desktop. Right. So I do hope I covered everything in this tutorial. And um, if I did and you like this video, please do click thumbs up and do subscribe to the channel. And I look forward to seeing you again. So this was Exquisite Info. Doing a very quick tutorial on how you can do multitasking on one desktop. Goodbye for now.